We're here on Middle Avenue in Carlton for a video tour of this versatile three or four bedroom detached property offered to the market with no upward chain. Just starting off at the roadside here, just have a quick look at the street around us. We'll have a good look at the outside of the property to start off before we head inside. First off, you'll notice that we have a nice low maintenance front garden. Pedestrian access gate leads up to a path down the side where we have entrance to the kitchen. You also get into the back garden from there as well. You can also see we have generous parking protected by a gate. That also then leads to the integral garage which has an electric roller shutter door with remote fob access. Garage does have both power and lighting. Currently used as storage, however, a good size. Dimensions are available in our marketing materials. We also have the added benefit as well for workshop to the rear. Currently has fitted shelving, both power and lighting again. An alternative access out into the back garden just to our left. Kitchen door is just to our left, which is used as the main entrance. We also have access to the boiler store to our left here as well. Access to power and lighting in here again. We have the wall mounted boiler. Just have a quick look at the rear garden. Chest with the front has all been designed with low maintenance in mind. Just outside of the conservatory, we have a low maintenance patio area. Plenty of room here for table and chairs. Path round to the workshop door. Enclosed by timber fencing for privacy. Mainly pebbled with a good variety of established plants and shrubs, useful outbuilding for storage. And on top of that, we also have a greenhouse there as well, just tucked away in the corner. And we'll start off inside in the kitchen. Currently fitted with a range of base and eye-level units, plenty of storage. Work surfaces incorporate a double bowl sink as well. Room underneath the countertops for freestanding white goods, plumbing for a washing machine, space for a fridge and freezer. We also have an integrated electric oven and hob, an extractor canopy above. We then have an inner hallway, which gives us access into the lounge to our right. What we've labeled as bedroom number three. Further reception room, nice and versatile, could be used as bedroom number four. WC, and then the main bathroom as well. We'll start off in the living room. It's nice and bright. Feature gas fire on the chimney breast and sliding patio doors take us into the conservatory. Could be used as a further sitting room 
nice views over the back garden and a door gives us access out to that patio area as well. Next off we have what we've labelled bedroom number three. Fitted wardrobes and storage. Nice big window overlooking the back garden. Room in here for a double bed. Reception room come bedroom four. Again, could be used as a double bedroom. Alternatively, plenty of space in here for a family table and chairs. Small flight of steps up to the upper floor where we have bedrooms one and two. WC fitted with a wash basin and toilet. And then just next door, the main family bathroom fitted with a bidet, wash basin, bath, WC, and then a good size shower cubicle as well. On top of that, we also have a fitted storage cupboard. Both bedrooms are quite similar in size, both doubles again. We've labeled this front room as bedroom number one just given the fitted sliding door mirrored wardrobes to the right. Window overlooking the front garden and driveway. And then finally we have bedroom number two. Plenty of room in here for a double bed as well as freestanding wardrobes again.